Hi, my name is Ashley Malone and I'm a Product Marketing Manager for Adobe. Today I'll be walking you through a demo of the integration between Adobe Document Cloud eSign Services and NetSuite. The use case we'll be going through is the process of sending a contract to a customer for signature. So we'll start from the perspective of the account executive in the organization who's been working with the customer. In our example, his name is Jared Shamba. The process begins on the NetSuite homepage. Jared first navigates to the Customers tab, and then continues to the record of the customer in question. Within the Acme customer record, Jared clicks on the Agreements tab and creates a new agreement. He can either create a custom agreement form or add an existing document already stored in NetSuite. Once the correct document is added, Jared tabs over to Recipients and can add the names of those who need to sign the document. In this example, the customer is Katie Tran. After she has been entered as a recipient, Jared has the option to change her role. He can choose to set any contact as a signer, an approver, or simply to be informed with a CC. Once the document and recipients have been added, Jared can now configure other details as he sees fit. He can add himself as a signer, change the signing order, he can set any number of security measures to protect the document, he can add an automatic reminder, and even change the language the recipient will see, making it just as easy to do business with international customers. Once he's finished editing, he clicks Save. And now we see the Send for Signature button. That means he can go ahead and send the document and we can see that the document has been sent. At any point while the document is still out for signature, Jared can send a reminder, cancel the agreement if something should change, or update the status manually. All right, so now the agreement has been sent to the customer, Katie Tran. So let's see what things look like from her end. Katie receives an email containing the agreement for her to review and sign. She just needs to click on the link to view the document. It opens up in a new tab where she can review it, and a helpful green arrow helps indicate where her approval is needed. Once she's finished reviewing, she then clicks where the sticky indicates to sign. A pop-up lets Katie type in her e-signature, or she can choose to draw it if she likes. No need to download software or third-party tools, and signing can occur on any device from anywhere. Once she's added her signature, Katie clicks the blue button to complete the process, and she sees that she has successfully e-signed the document. Now the agreement is sent to all parties. Now that the document has been signed, let's go back to Jared's perspective to see how the process finishes up. Back in NetSuite, the document status automatically updates that the document has been signed. Jared can also view an audit trail of the actions taken on the document, providing complete transparency into the signing process. and we can see that the signed document is now listed in the Agreements section of the customer record. Jared can return to this section at any time to easily view the agreement. And that's it! With Adobe Document Cloud eSign services integrated into NetSuite, you can get quotes, contracts, and other agreements eSigned in minutes without ever leaving your NetSuite account.